Uh, hello everybody, good morning. Uh, because we're reopening on Wednesday, this is the last tutorial. Well, it's a tutorial uh, with a difference today. Uh, if you have been following the um, coaching videos over the last two or three weeks, so thank you. Um, some of them I know it's been difficult, um, being sort of not very audible with the wind we've had, but uh, we've done our best and hopefully you've picked up one or two tips that will help you when you get back to your game. Golf's an extraordinary sport. I've been in teaching for over 40 years, as I've said many times, and in all the thousands of people I've taught and encountered, I don't think I've seen two swings the same. We've all got different uh, nuances and so on. I suppose it doesn't matter, providing we get back to the ball square uh, from the right plane and so on, that's all that matters. And if we look on the tour, there's some very unorthodox swings out there where they're still great players, and but they've hit millions of balls rerouting the club and, and, and finding the back of the ball. My mantra in teaching is very much that the, the, the less pressure we put on our body, the better. And, and if we have a, a technique that is onerous, we might get away with it in our early years, but later on in life, uh, we might get injuries from that and it might curtail our playing career. So I think the easiest way is to get the basics right and take pressure off the body. But I just want to show you a few swings um, that I've encountered over the years. Uh, any resemblance to anyone now living is purely coincidental, so please don't take this uh, personally. Um, but um, I'll try and copy a few of the things that I've encountered. So, letting this lady go fast with her dog. Um, we'll start off with what I call the balletic swing. That is somebody I taught quite recently, which we took a little while to get rid of that particular movement. Uh, we've then got the hockey shot. Pretty accurate, but not a lot of power. We then got the, the willowy swing. Not very elegant, not very powerful. We've got the reverse tilt. And then backing up out of it. Few people are taught of it doing that until we sorted them out. We've got the quick hit shot or the chicken wing, as we call it. We've got the sway off the ball. It's gone quite a long way, it's gone sideways, but it's gone quite a long way. We've got the Jim Furick. There you go, that's the best shot so far, so obviously that works. Um, left heel off the ground, another very common one, trying to, trying to manufacture loft. Very common one. So tens of thousands of people have taught over the years, literally not two swings alike. So if you are doing any of those swings there and that the club isn't being delivered up the back of the ball, then of course it needs to be changed. All of those didn't feel very comfortable. So if I hit lots of shots doing any of those swings, I think I'd end up uh, in traction. So uh, again, thank you for watching the videos. Um, we'll be back from Wednesday. Hope you can get your tea times booked. I think it's gonna be a, a mad rush to do so. I hope the weather continues. Very frustrating again as back in the spring that through most of lockdown, the weather's been really, really great for golf. But anyway, nothing we can do about it. So I look forward to seeing you all. All my team will be back from the middle of this week and uh, we wish you all the best and look forward to catching up with you then. Take care, bye-bye.